I bet with Interbet only. They're a fantastic site. I've never had any issues with them. They are very professional. There's never a problem. You deposit money, two seconds later it's in your account. You withdraw, which I do very occasionally. And uh, I believe it's also two seconds it's in your account. Well, on to race number nine, it's over 1400 meters, merit rated 92 handicap and let's bring up the field at the time of recording, 12 go to post, the betting number one at 7 to 2, number 3 at 7 to 1, 4 at 5 to 1, 6 at 9 to 2 and then it is 10 to 1 and better the balance, uh, let's just make sure if that, yep it is 10 to 1 and better the balance. So uh, this ninth race, uh, did I give you horse number three there? Yes, I did. Yep, it's 10 to 1 and better the balance. So, yeah, this this ninth race, I think if you're running in the exotics, especially the pick six, you are not going to feel confident if you've narrowed things down because you could get some type of results here. That wouldn't surprise me. I like the look of the first half of the meeting. And then as we get to the closing stages of the race meeting, for me, it gets much tougher the latter part of this race mean let me just give you short comments on each runner here number one al dante mj Ordendal, and chase mojin excellent form last two runs close up seconds i think you will get a solid run uh, seven to two you're gonna have to be the judge number two kg's delight card bullers runner two very good post maiden runs and 52 kg's only on the back Number three, Lord Wiley, what a ride, Sumanga Kumalo, take a bow, last time out, excellent ride to win uh, on the poly track, beaten captain who, he gets the ride again. Bowie hasn't won for 608 days, but the signs are there, last three runs have all been close, especially that last start behind William Robertson, must have a strong winning chance. Five, Nelson Bay, uh, Peter Musket's runner. Well, when this horse won at Hollywood Bet Scottsville at that penultimate start, I was actually blown away the way he just quickened away from the opposition because I liked Al Dante that day and followed that up with another good run. Richard Free up. Fast love, Johan Janssen van Fieren's uh, uh, six-year-old. I mean, if this has to win and you got this in the pick six, it'll be possibly one of the better results for you uh, when it, you have a look at the dividend. Number seven, imposing Michael Roberts' runner. 468 days since this one but last time out behind Nelson Bay it was a good effort if you like Nelson Bay you can't ignore this horse's chances eight passage of power ignore that last start behind Nelson Bay I think this horse was not himself on the day we know how capable he is number eight passage of power Robbie Hill and Serena Mudley. nine romance in Rome Mike Miller's runner on that last start behind master Josh I'll definitely give this my vote in the pick six. 10, Diani. Good ride from Serena Mudley to win over 1,200 meters last time out. Is a horse that's very capable. He's already a five-time winner. 11, now I got you from the Cory Lensley stable. Nice to have Cory Lensley in town. I know that this horse was very highly thought of as a three-year-old. Another that hasn't won in some time. 483 days. Could Corey Lensley have picked the right spot for this horse to win again? Because he's been a one-time winner for some time now. 12, Kamora, Tony Rivlin's runner. Well, have a look at Muzi's yearnings record on this individual. Five rides, two wins, two seconds. Can't overlook his chances, although he's in double figures. And that's a comment on all of the runners here in race number nine. And then all said and done, we have to give you a roving banker which horse it's going to be well for me it's going to be the hollywood syndicate number four bowie uh, my name's danny deliberto founder of ladles of love it was founded back in 2014. communities we we work with are all over the peninsula and um, we're working with 138 beneficiaries now we've grown exponentially um, we've been able to do that because of all the kindness that we have experienced um, from individuals and corporates such as uh, Interbet who just want to be part of the change.